hi guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is compassion i'm too serious hi guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is why am i too excited as a person give me money hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is compassion yes you got that correct compassion every time i introduce myself and i'm like my name is compassion i always get this look like and the people that don't have the courage to open their mouths and talk will be like, compassion. Wow. <laughs> yes, that's my name. My parents gave that name to me and all of that and all of that. Story for another day. So, I'm a newbie on YouTube. I uploaded my first YouTube video yesterday. And this video is basically to redeem myself from the first video. Like, after I uploaded that video, when I went to watch it, not even talk of the struggle before I uploaded the video. When I went to watch the video, I'm, I'm like, no man, even me, I will not watch this video. I spent five hours, yes, five hours to upload that video. And, oh God, that video was nothing to write home about. Like, my editing was zero, blah, 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 blah. So now, I'm making this video. Today's video is going to be all about setting up for makeup. You are a new makeup artist or you are trying to learn how to do makeup or you are a beginner makeup artist. You don't have people yet. You are just trying to build up your makeup life or your makeup studio or whatever the case may be so you are looking out for products so if that is what you are all about right now then this video is for you so we'll be going through all of my makeup items how i pack my makeup items items nothing really serious just your little little regular regular stuff that's what we have here so my yesterday's video I don't want to dwell much on that video that's one of the reasons why i decided to i'm like ah, i must make a new video today 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 like this so because if somebody goes to go and watch that video they'll be like ah this girl this girl has has casted and if you watch that video there's a point where i said if i if i don't make the first move i'll actually never start it so this is it i made that first video and it was rubbish that's why I'm coming here to make another video to try to how do I call it? How do I how do I say it? To try to balance up for what I did yesterday. Do you understand? So I'm hoping that this is the consistency I am starting this video with is going to continue. Did I mention that I do not have a camera for my YouTube channel? I am using my phone camera and then I do not have ring lights led lights lights and all of that for my channel i am using the lighting from my window <laughs> yes so i am hoping that as time goes on just as i just uploaded my first youtube video and it was wrong and i decided to try to correct it i am hoping that i would also see the need to i would definitely see the need but to get to get a new camera get at least even if it is one light for my channel so as to improve the quality of my video but this channel and this camera and the light i have from my window it's not so bad though it's not bad at all <laughs> and then please forgive my hair no earrings and all of that we'll try to do more with um, costume and our looks as time goes on so yeah you're going to actually excuse some of the things i use for my makeup like like i said i am just starting i've not even i've not even gone to register in a makeup studio like to properly learn how to do makeup i only watch youtube videos and i start learning how to do makeup i start improving my makeup life something like that 
so much so that I, 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 at some point, I started doing makeup for people and they pay me. Yes. And I didn't go to any makeup school. But I am planning on going to a makeup school. I'm going to register for one very soon because I want to open a makeup studio and make it like a full-time business. So I'm just going to show you what I use to pack. To start with, I don't even have a makeup box. I just have a bag where I pack my makeup stuff in it. So let's go straight into the video. So if you know this bag very well, you know that some people use this bag as their lunch box, something like that. But I use it as my makeup box. And I carry it with pride. <laughs> so here I have my paints and I keep my keys and all. I tie gilly as well. So I have paints that I keep inside here. And then my keys or my phones. My phone. I don't have two phones. My phone. When I want to go for makeup. Like I said, I used to do makeup for people even though I didn't properly go to learn how to do makeup so this box i got it from someone in kapanchan his name is lion if you know kapanchan his his shop is close to zenith bank no uba bank very close to college of nursing where i am serving so the first thing so i'm trying to show you how i pack this box or this bag when I'm going for my makeup and the things that I have inside the bag. So this is my lash tray. I don't know. The name is Jopet Beauty, I think. So I just have two of it left. That's to show you that even without going to a makeup school, I've actually been doing makeup for people. <laughs> yeah, so this is my lash tray. I got it from... Obli, Obli Jumok on IG and I think I got it for 7,000 naira. so this is the first thing I put in my makeup box then moving forward I have this V Beauty powder palette I got it as well from the same person um, Obli Jumok I, I, I hope I'm getting this name correct Obli Jumok on IG. So, this is my powder palette. V Beauty powder palette. I got it from Obli Jumok on Instagram. I don't have a setting powder. So, I use two shades lighter. A powder that is two shades lighter for whoever I am using as my setting powder. And to be honest, it actually works. So, before I get... A certain powder this is what i use this is the hack i use so doesn't want to close really i don't want this video to be long so be beauty this is the second thing then up next my eyeshadow palette. I have this reload eyeshadow palette again from V Beauty. I got it again from the same person on Instagram, Obli Jumok. On Instagram. And oh, the colors in this eyeshadow palette, I love, I love, I love, I love, I love, I love. Can you see that? Yeah. So, they are actually really beautiful colors here and it really works magic for me i would say some of the products i use some of them are actually good they are not so bad so that is what is probably helping me in my makeup life so this is the next thing then up next i have this eyeshadow palette this this eyeshadow palette i have two eyeshadow palettes this eyeshadow palette is up to five years now 
jeez five years or six years i got this eyeshadow palette from my sister-in-law shout out to erica and this eyeshadow palette can you see that can you see that like it really does magic so shout out to my sister -in -law. she gave this to me then up next i have this blush girls night out i got it again from ugly jumok on instagram and i love i love i love i love the colors the pigmentation is bomb these things are really good man and i spent money i spent money to buy these things then up next what do we have next this bag this bag they brought something in this bag i can't remember what it is and i decided to improvise use it for my makeup thing so i put some of my makeup things in this bag so i'm going to be showing you what i put in this bag i put this when i put the things in this bag then i keep it inside the makeup bag i have here it helps my bag to look more arranged if you understand what i mean so first in this bag i have i have my foundation i have three shades of foundation i've actually never had to work with somebody that is very very light so this is the light lighter person i've ever worked with this girl foundation in the shade what is this mocha 25 can you see that 25 so this is the lighter person i've had to work with then i have the shade bronze 30 then i have 35 cacao cacao whatever it is so they are all zikel products i have shade 25 30 and 35 i don't know i used to mix up sometimes i mix up um foundations to get a particular shade i'm always mixing 30 and 25 to get my shade 35 is too dark for me and 30 is too light so i have to mix it up to get my shade and to mix it up to get anybody's shade not necessarily my shade i use this stuff so this is um a zaron powder i think this is a powder stuff i can't remember now but this thing is very old after the powder finished i decided to start using it to mix my foundation in it you can see that it's all stained up i've been mixing foundations in it and then i use it so this is what i use to mix my foundation you can just have anything and you just want to improvise and use it you don't have to go all out because you're just starting uh, some things you just have to make do with what you have then i have my concealers i have different different shades of the concealer they are all la girl pro conceal i got it from um that same ugly jumok on instagram for the decal um, foundation i got them for 225 and then this i got them for 18 i think i bought a lot of decal at that time because i wanted to sell it so i think she sold it for me for two 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 or two three i can't remember and this she sold it for me for one five because it retails for one eight so she sold it for one five since i got a lot of it to sell at the time then i have my primer the stay matte primer that is what i use to prime then up next i have my eye pencils they are all davis eye pencils in the shade number three I use for drying my brows 
sorry if I have my eye pencils so they're also there then I have mascara eyeliner I have quite a lot of them <laughs> so this I got it from a store in Kafachan cute house and his beauty Sometimes when I try to use it and some things and it doesn't work, I just drop it. And then I also got this love potion, V Beauty from Oblige Mock on Instagram. Then Mega Impact Mascara as well. And basically, these are my mascaras and eyeliner that I use. Then I have this classic lash glue and it really it really holds well it really holds the mascara well but some people always say they prefer bonding glue so i have this bonding glue if you want bonding glue i use bonding glue for you if you want to use this i use this okay. then my liner i use it to do the wink line in the shade black eye studio eyeliner gel long wear then i have my beauty blender yeah then i have this hair wax after the makeup you want to do all those them baby hairs and all of that so i use this hair wax for that i have this zikel powder this is for dark skin in the shade Capucino. Ah, Zikel. <laughs> in the shade Capucino. So that's that. So this is the black or power powder I got from my sister. I want to try and see if I can use it as a setting powder as opposed to using those um, powder shades on my powder palette. So I'm going to try this. When I try it, if it works, I'm going to let you know. Then I have lipsticks, lip gloss over here. These are the lipsticks and the lip gloss I have. So I can't remember where I got all of them. Generally, I was just getting things and some I got from maybe friends and all of that. Then I have this milk of magnesia. I also got it from Ugly Jumak on Instagram. So this is going here. Then I have my lip balm. Then I have this Kiss Beauty Makeup Fix Spray in aloe vera. So that's that for this box right about now so i'm going to be zipping that so lip gloss then this stuff here i use it sometimes when i want to get maybe an angle here or sometimes when i want when i press on my powder to use it for my setting underneath my eye then these wipes i love to use these wipes i don't i honestly don't even know why it's almost finished i'll have to get a new one then my face define face definer la pride face definer Then cutting boards. Sometimes I need to use cutting board for probably I'm picking something on the eye or something. So I use my cutting board. I already showed you this. Then I have my brushes. My brushes are scattered, I know. So I first had um, Bobby Brown brushes. I got them since I was in 100 level, I think. I can't remember. 
I got it in Central Market in Kaduna. Then later on, after some things started getting missing, and when I decided to start saying uh, I want to start doing makeup, like then I got a new set of brushes. So this first, the first one I got is Bobby Brown. Bobby Brown. Then the second one, I got it from Ugly Jumok. I don't know if, it, if they have names. They don't have names at all. They just came nameless in a white pack. So this, um, this stuff, this thing I'm using to pack it, it came with the Bobby Brown set of, um, brushes when I got the Bobby Brown. So I just roll all of it in here. Roll it this way, put it in the makeup box, and that's that about that as far as that is concerned. And I zip. And as you can see, my makeup box is neatly packed, and I just grab and take. For my makeup if i get called for makeup or somebody comes to my place for makeup so that's that about how i pack the products i use for my makeup as a makeup beginner before i go and learn for my makeup and see what other things i need to buy to add up to this and hopefully get a makeup box so now that i have shown you the products I use for my makeup and how I pack for my makeup. You want to start your own makeup as well. You want to start doing makeup for people. You don't necessarily have to start beating yourself up because you don't have a makeup box or because you don't have a lot of things. You can improvise just like I don't have a setting powder. I improvise. I use my powder palette. I use two shades light for somebody on their face and I get what I want. The trick is to blend 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 use whatever you have and try to make it look good so you don't have to break the bank go extra miles to try to do things because you want to be extra about it so if product box or whatever it is was the reason why you've not started your makeup career now i have shown you how i'm also managing my stuff but i still get to do makeup for people so you should also jump on the opportunity get the things you have and try to start something and do your own makeup for yourself as well i hope this video helps you helps to encourage you to start your own makeup career if you like this video please give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel please like comment share and i hope that this video helps to redeem my first video because after my first video a moment i don't know i don't know about that video but we move we what we move so see you in my next video please don't forget to like comment and share thank you